Hey y'all, um, this one's going to be about uh, installing Nemo File Manager. Um, it doesn't actually replace Nautilus. Nautilus is still present. Nautilus is the default file manager in Ubuntu, which it has been for quite a long time. Uh, so Nemo, I made a shortcut here on the sidebar. This is Nemo File Manager. And uh, there's a whole bunch of things uh, that you can do with this. Um, so, for example, um, things removed from Nautilus. The status bar, which is here. Uh, it's no longer present in uh, 3.6 whatever. Compact view, that's not there anymore. Type ahead, find, save. I'm looking for like bash, dot bash. See, it's in line here. It's not, uh, it doesn't jump you to the folder or the window. Or to a separate uh, tab. Uh, uh, new file templates. Uh, yes, they had they included the new empty DOM, but on templates like you know, Open Office or LibreOffice and etc. Cetera, etc. Cetera. Application menu is gone. Huh. Uh, the goal menu is gone. Split screen, which I find so handy, it's gone. Tree view is gone. Bookmark. Menu items is gone. Backspace shortcut to return to the parent folder is gone. All those things are back and more in Nautilus. Um, for example, I can uh, say downloads, open a new tab. This new tab. I can also take the tab and, if I wanted to, and drag it out and you know do a split view that way. Uh, press Control Q will close both those windows. Go back to here. Uh, F3, split screen, save as at Ubuntu 1. I wanted to copy something from documents over to documents here. I could. When I'm done, just press F3 again and press backspace and you're home. Um, right click. I'm not going to do this. Oops. No. It keeps taking me away. Sorry about that. Try it again. There it is. Open as root. You can open uh, a folder as root. So you type in your password. Then you can browse the file system as root and manipulate files on the root level. And there's copy to and whatever you have bookmark. I mean move to or copy to and whatever you have bookmark. You can take a file or a folder. Uh, make link. Open new tab, that's on the folder. Right click, create launcher. Thank you. I miss have, not having that. There's create new documents. There's no templates installed, but you can do that through something like Ubuntu uh, Tweak Tool. And it also uh, retains the zoom level, I guess, as you call it. Uh, so for example, this is the default 50% view. If I go to the wallpapers, I just used the mouse wheel and zoomed in, and now it's larger icons, but it's not all like across all folders, which is obviously good in most cases. And also, you can tell uh, Nautilus to show the size, or you can tell it to show the size on no matter what the zoom level is. And the different views are here. There's your compact view, and. Uh, of course, you can control L and change to a directory. Control L again. Uh, there's a refresh button. There's the home button, computer button, and then there's like a little breadcrumbs menu here. So uh, yeah. So enough about uh, Nemo itself. How do you get this thing? Huh? Okay. So uh, install Nemo Ubuntu. Pretty straightforward. I'll put this in the description. That's sudo apt add add apt repository and then this uh, PPA. Then you know you get update and then install Nemo. Log out. Okay. And when you log back in, <coughs> you'll notice that things like uh, if you set the transparency of this or if you take, say, a website and you drag it as a link, it, it's no longer a link, it's just a, a HTML document. Uh, what you want to do is issue this command and it 
uh, you open up uh, startup applications and it says files but it is Nemo so you untick that so Nemo doesn't log in to the desktop you, at login sorry um, you still have Nemo but you have the functionality of the Nautilus, Nautilus uh, functions if that made any sense and I think that's it uh, the only downside to that is it pulls down Cinnamon Desktop. Now, I haven't logged into it yet, but so far I haven't noticed any adverse effects from using Nemo or having uh, Cinnamon as another desktop environment alongside uh, Ubuntu Unity. Uh, and it's pretty functional. Uh, I set a hotkey to Alt Home to open that. You can do that in your keyboard shortcuts. You can have whatever you wish. And uh, I think that should be it. Pretty straightforward uh, to install. If you're not comfortable with log, just logging out, just uh, just reboot. That usually solves any kind of problems that you may have. Uh, so yeah, Nautilus, uh, Nautilus Nemo, sorry. Uh, lots of great features in it. Uh, I wish Ubuntu, Ubuntu would... Uh, incorporate that into the next release but I'm not holding my breath but in the meantime we have Nemo okay so that's it and thank you so much for watching and we'll talk to you soon and bye for now